Hey guys, it's uh, Angelo Christian. Thank you for watching Real Estate Insider. Today we have a special edition for you developers, you real estate investors out there. You know, one of the biggest challenges facing the real estate development community right now, investors and developers accordingly, is access to capital. So here with Angelo Christian Financial, we have the capital and the debt stack the structure to help you guys out there to scale your deal, whether it's a multifamily, senior living, student housing, retail strip center, hotel, uh, you know, master plan community. You know, one of the things that I see with a lot of investors that I meet with is that they're wanting to expand and they've tapped into their friends and family to you know get the equity, but now they want to grow and they need access to more equity in order to build out and expand their developments. And so we're meeting with a lot of investors all over the country right now uh, that are doing you know $10 million plus deals and they've kind of gone outside of their circle and they need more equity in order to do more projects. And so today that's what we're actually gonna be talking about is how and where to get the debt and the equity. Because it's very easy sometimes you know, to get the debt for your project, but it's sometimes it's hard to get the equity in order to get your project to get developed. Whether again, it's a master plan community, uh, it's a multifamily project. So we'll go through some examples today, but I wanna let you know here with our private equity firm, we can actually help you to source the debt and the equity and give you phenomenal terms so that way you can do more deals and you know help more people help the economy more and obviously make more money so that's what we're going to be talking about today is how and where to get the debt and equity uh, to get more deals going so the first thing is, is that what i want to talk about is you know some of the requirements some of the benefits in order to even pull this thing off so the first thing that's important is that these are for experienced sponsors, experienced investors. If you're a first time investor, you're not gonna be able to pull in other investors to back your project. So generally the type of people that we're working with and that we're looking for that are doing $10 million plus deals, right? They have you know at least you know 10 plus years of experience of doing development type transactions, whether they have a large portfolio, uh, they have a group of investors, but they have, they're very seasoned, they're very savvy and experienced with doing real estate deals, right? Um, the other thing is that you have to have a strong, someone that has a strong sponsor, great credit. You have to have at least a 700 or higher credit score preferred. Um, you know, good, strong, personal financial statement is critical. Uh, the other thing is that what's awesome about how we can structure these deals is they can be non-recourse. So that's very, very powerful so they don't have to come after you personally. Um, and then the other thing is that you have investor backing. And we're gonna go through an example of how you only need a little bit of capital as opposed to a large amount of money down because uh, we have our investors that will actually back you and step in to fund your project. Um, you know, and then the other thing is, like I said, you scale, you can do more deals. Instead of doing one deal every two or three years, now if you have the equity and the debt, now maybe you can do a couple deals every year and make more money. So that's what it's about and obviously, putting more jobs out there, getting the economy going. So this is a very, very important uh, video for you investors out there that are doing bigger projects and you're trying to figure out where to get the debt and the equity. So uh, we'll go into an example here because I think it's important uh, that we actually talk about it. So uh, we'll go through some of these scenarios so you can actually see what it looks like. I'll give you an example of one that we just did. It was a, $40 million deal, multifamily ground up construction, a 200 unit. So 40 million, 200 unit. Multifamily, and we're doing a lot of multifamily ground up construction. Okay, so typically if you were gonna build this project, you'd have to put 25% down, right? So that's, that we already, if you look at, if you went to a bank, you went to, you know, uh, some type of equity lender or some type of investment bank, they're gonna want 25% down. A real estate trust, they're gonna want 25% down. They'll fund 75% of cost. So one of the challenges that you see is, okay, that's, if you look at what 45%, that's 10 million that you have to put down of your own capital. Um, so, the challenge with that is that's 10 million down, down payment. Okay. 
So a lot of people are like, well, hey, you know, I don't really, ha I don't really want to put ten million dollars down. I don't have ten million. Um, you know, I have some money. I can put some money down, but I can't put ten million down. I might be able to get a little bit of money down, but I can't do that much, or it's going to tie up all my capital. But I have this great project, this beautiful project that I want to build. I have a sweet deal, but I don't have ten million to put down. That's what the bank's going to tell you, and the bank is also going to want, you know, usually a full recourse loan meaning that you're on the hook for the deal, okay? So, you know, what are you gonna do? You're just gonna sit and not do your project or are you gonna try and figure out how do you get your project funded? That's where we come in because we can help you to get this project built to give you the, help you with the down payment and give you the loan. So this is if you walked into a bank, you know, they give you, you know, uh, this type of loan and then, um, you know, you start your project and get building but you know, if you don't have ten million dollars, then you're you're kind of stuck, right? Well, I'm coming with a solution here to get you the funding, so that way you can get your development built. So what I'm proposing uh, instead is what we can do is a debt and equity stack. We'll give you the debt and the equity. So it'll look like this. Instead of you having to put 10 million down, you only put down 10%. So sponsor puts 10% down equals 4 million. Okay. Investor puts 90% of the down payment. Okay. Or the remainder. So if you have to put 10% down on the project and he's going to put the remainder, the investor is going to put Let's just say he's gonna cover the rest of it, so he's gonna cover six million down because you're gonna put, of the project, if you're gonna be putting 10% down, he's gonna be putting the remainder down. So on this deal right here, he's gonna be covering the six million, okay? Now, what'll happen is on the loan, we can do a non-recourse loan with bad boy carve outs, meaning that we'll have some recourse if there's you know malfeasance or fraud or anything like that, but it'll be non-recourse, nothing against your personal assets. And you'll have a lower interest rate, it'll be a LIBOR plus 350 basis points. So you have a very low interest rate on the construction, on the debt. Okay? That's very, very powerful. Now, the distribution of the equity is, so what'll happen is you're gonna pay your investor preferred returns. You're gonna give your investor, let's say that you pay investor, pay investor returns seven to 8%, okay? Now, the investor, for them to give you the six million, Right, that's that's a, you know very generous for them to do that. They need to get compensated for it. So, you know, typically they're going to want until they hit, you know, an, an internal rate of return equal to maybe fifteen percent. You're going to have like a waterfall type structure to where you're going to have a deferred equity uh, if you are the sponsor. So you're not going to own one hundred percent of the development anymore because you had other people come in. So, but you will be able to recapture that equity in the property as performance uh, hurdles are achieved. So you have deferred equity. So so in the, in the beginning, you might only own, so this might be your ownership structure, 30% of the project in the beginning, and then year one, or year one, year two, year three, year four. So 35%, 40%, 45 percent, 50%. Okay, so what is this, what am I saying here? So what I'm saying is as the development gets built out, you're gonna have more equity in the property, okay? 
you met these performance metrics, you paid your investors their returns. As you're paying them and you know, you're hitting your, your NOI, you're hitting your, your projections with vacancy, you're gonna get more equity and more ownership back, right? Like a sweat equity, a deferred equity, because hey, you're managing this whole thing. You're the developer, you're the builder. You had a dream to build this master plan community. We did a $120 million master plan community. We've done this $40 million, I mean, just whatever it is. So what I'm telling you is that you don't have to sit on your dream. You can get the equity, you can get the debt if you have a very good offering memorandum, you have a very good package, you have experience. We can help you to get the debt and the equity to source that capital so that way you can get your, your dream out into the world and reality and actually make it happen. This is, the, this is the path and how to do that. And over time, as these investors get paid off and they see that, hey, this guy knows what he's doing, you're gonna have more and more equity in your property. So it's very, very powerful. Um, and so, and it's a lot better than working with the banks because the banks aren't gonna do this for you. They're not gonna come in as an equity partner and help you to realize your vision, right? The bank is just gonna give you the debt and say, give me 25% down and put you on a balloon matured loan and probably have you as a full recourse loan program. Whereas this is more of a customizable package that's really tailored to help you to get your project up and running. So if you're a investor out there and you're trying to do at least a $10 million project or higher, reach out to our office at 832-431-6331. I wanna talk to you, I don't care where the project is, whether it's in Hawaii, New York, California, Texas, Florida, we wanna help you to get the funding. You can call us at 832-431-6331. Again, if you need help with it, you got a great package, you got, you're got you a good sponsor, and you need, you need help with the equity and the debt, this is where you have the source to give you the debt and the equity to help you with that. So call our office at 832-431-6331. I want you to check out my next video, Fannie Mae versus the Banks.